Amen. If that so-called prophecy Lord. was for God people, God people's everywhere. That's right. That's right. That is not the teaching no, of the first church of the Lord Jesus Christ. No. That is not a prophecy from heaven either. Who is he that saith? God said what I say to one, I say to all. That's right. That's if right. that prophecy came from God, why is it a little patch of Oklahoma is for Puerto Rico and not all of God's people? Amen. Amen. There will not be no nuclear warhead bombing and getting rid of America in 2026. Go ahead. No! Go ahead. It won't happen. Amen. Wonderful, wonderful teacher. Wonderful, wonderful. Wonderful, brother. The Bible said the spirit of the prophet is subject to the prophets. prophets. That's a lie. That's a lie. They didn't come from God. That's right. That's a lie. Amen. Who is he that saith? Who is he that saith? And it comes and to, it pass come to pass when the when Lord, Lord it not. didn't command nothing. That's right. Hallelujah. You remember the first church? You've been tricked. Yeah. Amen. Don't sell your house. Amen. Don't drain your bank account and move to Puerto Rico whenever God took his people from one land to the other, it was flowing with milk and honey. That's right. That's right. It was better than where we was. That's right. That's right. That's right. Wonderful. God ain't said nothing. That's right. China is not gonna bomb America in 2026 and wipe out America. Amen. China ain't doing it. No. It ain't time for the destruction of this entire country. That's There's right. holy people here. That's right. Go ahead. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. There's holy people here. Wonderful. Go ahead. Hallelujah! Glory. Glory to God. Go ahead. It's not going to happen. No. Wonderful. In the days of Noah, Noah and Methuselah were sent by God to warn the people of that time of world destruction. Noah, by God's permission, prepared an ark for the saving of his house. The church having started. America will be here. We will be here. Amen. Truth of God is not coming to an end. No way. In four more years? No! God has another agenda. That's for the gospel to be preached. God said this gospel of the kingdom must hallelujah, be preached to all the world. Then then That's it. shall the end come. That's right. Not before. That's right. Hallelujah. Don't you sell your house. Amen. And then give part of it to a church. Yeah. It's a lie. Oh, yeah. That prophecy did not come from God. No. It's a lie. Amen. Amen. It is not the first church of the Lord Jesus Christ. It's a lie. That's right. That's right. Wonderful. Lamentations, skip chapter and verse. Lamentations chapter 3 and at verse 37. Says what? Who is he that says? Who is he? Amen. 
that saith, and it cometh to pass. I'm willing to put my life on it. Oh yes. 2026 will be here. Amen. I will be here. I'm willing to put my life on it. The gospel will be here. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. The word of God will be here. Being preached right here in America. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Wonderful. Wonderful. That's a lie. That's a lie. The Lord ain't said nothing. No. Who is he that saith? Who is he that saith? And it cometh to pass. And it come to pass. When the Lord commandeth it not. And the Lord didn't command it? Didn't command it. That's God right. did not speak to him. Amen. To tell you to pack up and go to Puerto Rico. Amen. That prophecy didn't come from God. No. There's a personal feeling. It's a presumptuous statement. Presumpt that's right. That's right. America gonna be here. The gospel gonna be here. Amen. The truth of God gonna be here. Amen. We gonna be celebrating God. Amen. Wonderful. When you get the word of God in you, in you, yeah. you won't take what people say, regardless if they're a family member. Amen. Get mad if you please. Yeah. Put your life on the line. That's it. I'm willing to put my life on the line that 2026 America will be here. Amen. Put yours on the line. Go ahead, man. Go ahead. And let the one that remain living declare he's of God. That's right. That's right. Hallelujah. My job don't end in no 2026. No way. No way. He said, preach the word. Hallelujah. 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 Preach it. No way. A whole lot of us still going to be right here. Right. It's going to be more in 2026 than it is now. More Hallelujah. of the increase of his government and peace, there shall be no end. Hallelujah. God did not tell my brother to tell the church, pack up, sell your house, sell your land, take your money out the bank, and go to Puerto Rico. God ain't made no such statement. Amen. How Campton told that lie. Amen. Yes, he did. Jim Jones said the same thing. That's right. That's, right. That's the spirit of deception. deception. This is why I've been teaching by God's permission for years. Do not get too close to family. Have your heart in God more than you are your own family. So if family go left, you stand still. That's it. Oklahoma, stand still. That's it. Stand still. Hallelujah. Yes. Stand still. That's it. Don't you withdraw a dime. Stand still. Wonderful, wonderful. And see the see. salvation of God. That's it. China bear the symbol of the dragon. America bear the symbol of the eagle. But it is not God's will that the dragon blow fire and consume this country. Go ahead, man. Go ahead, brother. Prayers. Hallelujah. Takes this eagle. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory. Hallelujah. Prayers. Takes this eagle. That God is how wicked it is. Yeah. Prayers protect this evil, wicked country. That's true. That's true. There's some holy people here. That's right. There's some righteous people here. That's right. And God will not forsake his own. That's right. 
So if God gave you a prophecy for everyone to pack up and move to Puerto Rico, why is it stuck as an Oklahoma prophecy? That's right. That's right. All these holy people around the world, Amen. baptized Holy Ghost filled believers, yeah. speaking in tongue down in Africa, speaking in tongue in the Bahama Islands, speaking in tongue in Europe, speaking in tongue in Iran, speaking in tongue in Kuwait. Amen. Right. Hallelujah. What is the ark for the world now? The church. That's the ark now. That prophecy did not come from God. No way. Never did. Never will. Amen. Never will. When 2026 come. It ain't gonna happen. I still be singing, turn the light on, Santa. I have no respect to person. When you lie on God, that's blaspheme. That's right. And when you blaspheme, you have damned your soul throughout eternity, even if you are a member or a minister in First Church. If God don't say it, shut up. If God don't say it, don't you say it. Hear me, Oklahoma. Amen. You have blasphemed against Jehovah himself. My Lord. 2026, it ain't gonna happen. My Lord, my Lord. Oh, to God, I can stand flat foot and look Kevin in the face and don't worry about being struck. That's right. There's a lot of work the truth of God still have to do. And it ain't over in 2026. No way. And, and I ain't going to Puerto Rico other than preach the gospel. So to all the truth of God followers, don't you believe that lie? If you took your money out, put it right back. Take care of your family. Don't sell your house. You live in a repetitious lie. Jim Jones did it. Hal Campton did it. Men done it before I was born and since I've been here. God never left himself without a witness. And whenever God sent a man to warn the people that a prophecy would affect a nation, then God make a way for that man to tell that nation. nation. That's right. That's right. I can declare to the world that God sent me to the world. That's right. And I'm telling the world, it's a lie. Amen. Amen. You can get mad all you want and say, well, as a result of that, we're no longer with First Church. That's quite all right. I'm going to preach the word of God, and a lie is a lie, and blaspheme is blaspheme. Lord. Blaspheme is not to be tolerated from nobody. Amen. You know how dangerous it is to say the Lord said something, yeah. and he ain't said it? Yeah. What do you think, God is a toy? Amen. Out of the mouth of two or three witnesses. Yeah. And every word be established. Where's your second witness? That's right. Everybody got to pack up to move to Puerto Rico. We all better get ready to sell our homes, money, get rid of your clothes, everything. Amen. This is what happens when you don't get the word of God in you. The devil will lead you. Yes, he will. Right in the truth, the devil will lead you. It doesn't matter if it's your daddy, your husband, your uncle. This is not a family church. This is God's church. That's right. Since the day God appeared unto me, and we begin to tell the people about this work, what we told them to date so far, everything, everything. has came to pass and they have witnessed it. That's right. Wasn't no off the wall ham and egg vision. No. Oh no. 
You ain't going to pay me to tell you God said something, and I know he didn't say it. I'm too scared. That's right. Well, how do you know that it ain't going to happen, Pastor Jennings? The word of God, things got to be fulfilled first. Right. One scripture says the end is not, not yet. yet. Not yet. It's not yet. No. America will not be wiped out in 2026. Hear me good? Hear me good? Hear me good? That's right. It will not be wiped out at all. The one way will still be here. The one way to God will still be preached. Amen. Right here in America. Right here. Churches will still be built. Souls will still give up and repent and be baptized in the name of Jesus Christ in 2026. Right here. Amen. We will take God in America. Amen. The work of God still be going on. Some of us will have more pains than before. But the work, hallelujah, will still be here. That's right. Wonderful. You're scattering God's people. Yeah. People watch the program thinking this is part of our teaching. Mm. Mm -mm. No. We don't believe in blaspheming against God. No way. You people get the word of God in you. Having. Having a form of godliness. That's a form. That's a form. Mm. That's a form. Amen. But what? But denying the power thereof. You deny scripture. God going to allow China to destroy America in 2026? Bombs fall every day somewhere. But America will not be wiped out no time soon. No. We're to God, it isn't time yet. That's right. The scripture says the end is not yet. Is not yet. That's it's what not, the word of God says. says. That's right. In the book of St. Matthew, chapter 24 and at verse 5. That's what? For many shall come in my name, saying, I am Christ. Many. That not only means that many will come saying they're Christ, it means that also. Yeah. But it also means that people will come in Christ's name. That's right. They will come speaking in the name of Jesus Christ. And also saying that they are Jesus the Christ. That's right. Uh -huh. For many shall come in my name, saying, I am Christ, and shall deceive many. What? And shall deceive many. They're going to trick a whole lot of folk. And ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. You're going to see. That's going to be. But the Holy Ghost says what? See, see that ye be not troubled. Wait a minute. Amen. So ain't no need for me to pack. Right. The Holy Ghost spoke plain. See that you be See in trouble. That you don't be disturbed. That's right. Why? For all these things must all come to pass. All these things must come to pass. But the but end is not yet. But, but the, end the end is not yet. It ain't over till it's over. That's right. That's right. That's right. America still will be here. 2023, 2024, 2025, 2026. America will be here. Hallelujah! It'll be right here. Right here. Word of God will be preached. Yeah. Amen. Amen. What little hair I got on top, my hair, I may shave my whole head by then. <laughs> don't know. Amen. My boys tease me now. Why don't you go on and shave it off and stop having that runway on your head? <laughs> Amen. Amen. <laughs> Amen. Mark me. Say, you just got a landing strip up there. Why don't you just, why don't you just go on and remove it? Glory to God. Amen. If you don't get the message of holiness in you, you will get too close to someone. And getting too close to them, you will take their word above the scriptures. And when you take their word above the scriptures, right then you step into a form of godliness. Having a form and you of deny the power thereof. That's right. And the Bible said when you got a form of godliness and deny the power thereof, what should I do? From such turn away. Amen. I denounce blasphemy. Yeah. I denounce it with Bible. That's right. It's not of God at all. 
Don't, don't, don't sell your property. Don't take your money out the bank. If you did, put it back. Amen. I'm telling you, America going to be right here. Amen. We're still going to be having conventions. I'm, are we still going to be in water? Baptizing in the name of Jesus Christ. Some of them that's seeking the Holy Ghost by 2026, some of the seekers going to have it. Yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Some of them going to have it. Amen. They long wait. Their prayer is going to finally be answered. Hallelujah. Amen. Some of the ones that never danced in the spirit, the Holy Ghost going to get a hold of them. Right behind the chair. <laughs> winging it out. Wonderful. Come on back to Bible. That's right. Come on back to Bible. Amen. Come on back. Glory to God. When you stray away from God's word, you're liable to fall into anything under the sun. That's right. Come back to Bible. There's not a scripture in the book that give you a doomsday date. Not one! Not one. That's right. Years ago before I was, I think I was, yeah, I think I was Pastor Jennings then. I was still in the basement. And Williams and I went and visited the late Bishop Hunter, little small church in West Philly. Williams and I were sitting in the back and he said, the Lord spoke to me in a dream. He said, I saw a ladder from earth into heaven. He said, on top of that ladder was the number 2005. And it was in the 90s when he said that. He said, the Lord let me know he's coming the year 2005. And here it is, 2022. I remember that as if it happened last night. Yep. I nudged Williams. I said, Williams, out of all the anointing this man had, he told a flat lie. Told a lie. It could have been someone's address <laughs> right. that you forgot. And the Holy Ghost could have been bringing it back to your remembrance. It could have been an address. Amen. That's the truth of it. Amen. Could have been a number you saw on the back of a license plate. Have you ever seen something and then you dream it? Now you undercover lottery players, don't you go play that? <laughs> you, you see some folk down there? <laughs> Writing it down. <laughs> Amen. Amen. That's what Bishop Hunter said. He saw a ladder. From earth into heaven, at the top, was 2005. That's right. And he said, the Lord let him know he's coming to year 2005, and he tried to clean it up that night. Yeah. He said, I didn't tell you the day and time. He said, the Bible said nobody know of the day or the hour. Yeah. He said, but the Bible didn't say the year. A year is a time. That's right. When the thing starts and ends, it's time attached. I don't care how long it is or how short. That's right. You better be careful. Here, here, hear the old man. You better be careful. Oh, yeah. If God did not speak to you, close your mouth. That's right. I am not one that's quick to get the jumping and shaking when someone come along and said, thus saith the Lord. I done lived through that stuff for years. I weigh things out with Bible. Amen. Yes, I have to, Bishop Williams. I weighed out with Bible. Yeah. The Bible is my scale. Oh, yes. Amen. Before I start pastoring, my former bishop called himself prophesying. Right in his office. He said, you will never amount to nothing. He said, God didn't tell you nothing. Yeah. He said, you tell me about some large church and going all around the world and churches around the world on the broadcast. He said, I'm telling you, Brother Gino, God ain't never spoke to you. I just sat quiet out of respect. 
And I was probably about mm, maybe 17 or 18 or 19. He was banging on the desk. That stuff didn't move me because the Lord spoke to me. And that's the, that visions that God gave me was the thing that kept me from backsliding as a young man. It gave me something to look forward to. He showed me today, yesterday, and that's the thing that kept me from backsliding. Kept me from backsliding. Kept me from making babies that wasn't married. I was determined I ain't having no child. I ain't married. Amen. I got a vision to look towards. <laughs> Hallelujah. Glory to God. It kept me looking forward to something. And now I'm in it. I'm standing, right. I'm standing right in it. That's right. Lamentations. Lamentations chapter 3 and verse 37. And what? Who is he that saith? Who are you? Who are you? That saith. The that Lord did not say it. Right. Yeah. I'm telling you, the Lord didn't say it. Get your house back. Get your bank account back if you can. <laughs> Al Campton, follow has done the same thing. You know what makes it so crazy? How Campton didn't sell his house and didn't drain a dime out of his account. Didn't do it. How Campton now is dead in a Christless grave, ready to be ushered in hell. That's right. Be careful with the thus saith the Lord syndrome. Oh, yeah. I don't care how much you shake, rattle, and roll. If, the, if you start moonwalking, <laughs> be careful you don't trip over yourself. That's right. Coming up in false church, it gave me a lot of experience. I saw a lot. And I heard a lot. Yeah. A lot of times today, I see the same thing. This is not a contest for who's more spiritual than the other. This is about leading God's people right. That's right. This ain't no contest. This is about leading the people so they can have a fair chance to enter into the kingdom of God. Wonderful. You hear this message, world? Amen. Wonderful. 2026 will come and go. And the next year, by God's permission, will roll in. And the word of God that thunders from the truth of God will be louder and louder and stronger and stronger. Hallelujah! Right here! Blasting out of America and to the world. Go back to the foundation of having a farm. Give chapter and verse. Back Everybody all right? Listen. Back in 2 Timothy chapter 3 and verse 5. What is it? Having a form of godliness. Having a form. Be real. Stop trying to impress people. Stop being what you know you're not. You might as well be real. God know what you are. Having a form of godliness. But denying the power. Deny the power. Deny the scripture. Deny the ability of God. From such. From such turn away. You get away from fakers. For you end up being one. Faking take a lot of energy time consuming but some folk they don't master it they got it so good they don't feel nothing you know some folk lie 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 so much they believe their own lie you know like Donald Trump like Trump yeah. Trump lies so much he believe his own lie some people are the same way they lie so much until they convince themselves that that lie is the truth That's right. you know the worst deceit is when you deceive yourself. Oh, yeah. And if you deceive yourself, you put yourself in a position you can't complain about when someone deceives you. Listen. Having a form of godliness, but denying the power thereof. What shall we do? From such turn away. Turn away. For of this sort are they which creep in the house. Of this sort, you got house creepers. And lead captive They lead women. captive what kind of women? Silly women. I don't want none of our sisters to be silly women. No. What are they? And lead captive silly women laden with sin. Laden, they're full of the devil. 
Led away with divers lust. Led away with all kind of lust. Ever learning. They learn everything else but what? And never able to come to the knowledge of the truth. You learn never. how to rob, you learn how to steal, you learn how to bamboozle, you learn how to swindle, you learn how to hustle. That's right. That's right. You learn how to play with some fellow's emotion. You done put her name on your account, now you broke and she done goat. <laughs> mother, what's that mother name they used to sing that song of danger walking in the dark? Mother Bowman, Brother Evans' mother, she used to sing that song, it's danger walking in the dark. You so overtaken by her look. You keep dumping that money, dumping that money, dumping that money, dumping that money, dumping that money. And then about five or 15 brothers is giving her the same offerings, if not more. Mm. She's like a tele-evangelist. <laughs> some of you sisters, some of you brothers are hitting you up. One sister paying mortgage, another paying rent, another paying gas, another paying electric. He ain't even got to work. Remember, my sister told me one day, I don't want my man to work. I told her to get out of my office. <laughs> get out of my office. Get out. She said, but Pastor Jennings, I got up out my chair, opened the door, and said, get out right now. Something wrong with you. She said, but I want to preserve my man, so, you know, so he don't get tired and get anything broken on. I said, get out. <laughs> Bible tell, <laughs> Bible tell a man to work by the sweat of his brow to hear you come along. Want your man to be SpongeBob. <laughs> I am ready. Oh, SpongeBob. Always squeaking when you walk. <laughs> you old crabby patty. <laughs> this is a sick, demented generation. Yes. Now, don't misunderstand me. Every person is not a user. And them kind is hard to come by. It's like meeting a Campbell with 10 humps, and each hump deliver you 10 flavors of ice cream. Some of these men will use you just like a woman would. That's right. I've met some women. I've told them he ain't nothing but using you. I know, but I love him. You know it? No. But yeah, you love him. But do you love yourself? I've met women so desperate for attention, they was willing to settle and be used. My Lord. Use a fool. That's a fool. Some men was the same way. Ha! <laughs> I remember one brother, I was talking to him. I said, brother, why are you getting this? Why are you letting this woman use you? They both were sitting in my office. He said, Pastor Jenner, do you see the way I look? <laughs> I said, huh? He said, Pastor Jennings, I know I am a ugly son. So if this woman is willing to use me and that get my attention, he said, I may sound crazy, but I, I, to be used, I'm willing to be used. He said, because I'm too ugly to get anybody else but her. I looked at her before I said anything. She just looked at me and said, he's ugly. Let the church sing. Let the church sing. Let the church sing. Amen. Who is it, God? My Lord. <laughs> Are you listening to what I'm telling you? Love yourself. 
And you won't become a wanderer seeking love for someone else who may not even know what love is. Love yourself enough not to settle for garbage. And then you gotta end up taking out the garbage. Sometimes the best day of some folk life is when the garbage man walked out. Or when the garbage woman walked out. That's right. Bear in mind what saith the scripture. Having a form Give chapter of, and verse again. 2 Timothy chapter 3 and at verse 5. What is it? Having a form of godliness. Having a form. Amen. Fakers, pretenders of godliness. But denying the power thereof. They deny the reality of God everlasting word. From such turn away. Don't hang with them. Get away from these frauds and fakers. That's right. I mean, you don't fall in love with someone because she's always shouting. That's what I want. That's what I want. That's what I want somebody spiritual just like that. How you know she's spiritual? You don't fall in love with a brother because he always got a tongue. That's right. Every time you talk about something, he's in a tongue. Brother, you know how to fix the engine? How about like I said? Brother, that's a nice cologne you're wearing. <laughs> Brother, where you going to eat? Chakauma. <laughs> <laughs> the Lord. Are you listening? So many thousands of letters I get that's repetitious in a statement. Where were you before I got married? I wish I would have heard this teaching before I got married. Amen. Amen. 